<coughs> Welcome to a session of dog therapy. Today we will be interviewing three customers and starting with Via Senior. So, Diego, what do you think of your problems? Doctor, I've, I've just been like really depressed lately. I don't know what it is. I used to be such a happy child. Yeah. So, since when have you been feeling this? Um, yesterday, the the tip of my pencil broke. And it, was, it was the last one that I had. Were you doing like an exam or? Um, close. I was just sharpening it. Mm -hmm. But um, it broke and it made me think about how life is like that pencil. It can just break at any point. Yeah, like, yeah. It made me think, what if my life is already broken? And then I looked and I noticed it was. I could tell my parents, my siblings, everybody around me just seemed so much happier than I was. Just brought me to where we are today. All right. So, how about how about you pet this fine specimen? Come on, go get the animal. See, Come even he doesn't love me. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. Dogs are just like that sometimes. It's dogs, okay. dogs are supposed to love everybody. Okay. They're, they're, um, so I'm going to diagnose you with, well, obviously depression, but, like, good job pointing that out on yourself. So, I will see you next week. Until then, I would suggest, um, trying to interact with your family and friends as much as possible, and doing what you like, because it'll just make you happier as a person. I'll see you next week. Same time. Alright? Can I take the dog with me? Um, sorry, that's, you can buy, a, you can buy a puppy at the, oh, okay. All right, next. Hey. Hi. All right. So, what do you what do you think your problem is? I have a um uh, a very strange uh, addiction to um to Swiss Miss. Oh, I thought hot they. Chocolate. I thought they did. You, did they pat you down? Yeah. But okay. So, what is your relationship with Swiss Miss? I, I I can't I I can't I can't stop. You can't stop Swiss Miss. I, I can't. Oh okay. So, what do you do with Swiss Miss? Swiss uh, Miss on like a regular day. Um. Uh, a lot of stuff. Would you say? Snort it. Oh okay. So. I think that um, having this much Swiss Miss is taking a toll on your health as a person and it's kind of driving you to a point of mentality where it's not healthy. So has your has your family or friends like noticed that you've been a little off lately? I don't have family or friends. Oh, um, okay. Well. So, what, how much Swiss Miss do you like take in a day, do you think? On average? Yeah. A lot. At least three. At least three pack packages? Or packets? Packets. Okay. That's not as bad as I thought it was, but. An hour. Oh. <laughs> um. Okay, so I I think I'm gonna diagnose you with. Um, so obviously we're gonna have to put you in a. It's kind of like a quarantine. You know what a quarantine is? No, I'm not going no, back. No, there. no, no, I'm not going back. Uh, okay, final customer. Hello. Hi. Um, alright. Edison was your name? Please! I have attachment issues. Yes, that's my name. Can they please love me? Yeah. Alright, so what do you think your problem is besides attachment issues? Like, Post traumatic is there... stress disorder, that's my name! Oh. I Because I can't go back to school, you know? Because every time I go to school, they keep me there for seven hours, and it's so long. I can't go back! 
That's cool. I can't go back. I need dogs and love. That's all I need. Okay? I just need dogs. All right, so um, <laughs> so sweet puffer son. So oh, do you have? So yeah. would you say you have like anxiety, like anxiety oh. of school? Like and I call that, but I have anxiety for everything, including this puffer. He's so cute. No, so what do I anxiety? Think? All right, so what's the biggest like problem that you have? Like, would it be school or not? Like, what would it be? School and you guys and this doggo and and that cameraman and and that tree. And, and, and everything. All right, so when you say you're anxious about the dog, I see you petting it right now, like affectionately. So how you, so how does PTSD relate to things that you like? Well, one time, right, I was at the park. And I, and I came to the park from school because I hated school. And a dog chased me and ate my foot and I ran into a tree and the cameraman started recording me like he is, and you started talking to me. And so, yeah. Okay, so I would suggest that you just take a little time to yourself. Maybe, uh-oh, Bill's getting a call. That's quite loud. Um, so yeah, I would prescribe you with, I don't know, just taking a little time to yourself and maybe off from like things that stress you out. And just like take time to do what you want to do. No, I can't go back. I can't go back. Okay. Um. You're bad. <laughs>